And you'll be so sad if you don't have the bag. Okay, so I went to Trader Joe's. I wanted to film more when I was in the store, but it was like crazy busy in there. So I wanted to do a little haul of the stuff I got because why not? I got some root beer. Apparently these are really good. Pepper Jack cheese, ground beef patties because we're going to make burgers this week. Bread and butter pickle chips, sea salt. I don't know why. We got sea salt. Why did we get sea salt? He likes sea salt. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Ooh, we got chicken tiki masala. We looked at like all the stuff to buy online and most of them were like sold out. So if you want to get things that are listed online, you have to go like on a weekday because like I wanted to get cheddar cheese, hash browns, ice cream sandwiches, but they were all sold out. So. If you want to go and get those, you have to like either go in the morning or go on a weekday because they people will just like grab them. Um, we got pork gyoza, orange chicken. Apparently these are similar to the Panda Express ones. So we're going to try them out and see if they are the same. I also got this tote bag, which is so cute. I was looking for like the traditional Trader Joe's canvas tote bag, but they only have the one in black and I want the white one So I didn't get it. I'm hoping that next time I go they'll be there. I got some potatoes white onions frozen pizza They had mini avocados <gasps> Look how cute they are. Usually the avocados in California are like massive I like that these are really tiny. I could just eat one for breakfast and they're the perfect size Oh, here, let me show you a comparison. This is like the regular avocados. And then this is the mini ones. You could really see that. Oh, this one's going bad. But you could really see the size comparison. And then for our burger, we got some brioche. Brioche buns. All right, so I kind of want to give you an update of my L-glutamine and L- is it L-carotene? I wanted to give you a little update on how that's going. I didn't do enough research on how to exactly take it, but I've been taking it every morning. Like as soon as I wake up, I would take the carotene and then I would go downstairs and take L-glutamine with apple juice because I can't take that with water because it's just it's not disgusting It's just not the best Tasting thing in the world What I have noticed about my body is that I don't bloat I mean if I eat a lot, I guess I just have a full stomach I'm like I just don't bloat like my stomach doesn't feel heavy or bloated all the time like when i was on my period i didn't feel like my stomach was rock hard and that little pouch thing i have it used to be like really big and but now it's like kind of blends in with my body you know i am supposed to be working out but i haven't been working out because i'm going through some shit okay oh, but i want to say so far it's been pretty good like I don't really have anything bad to say about it but I do notice like a difference in my body like I feel like my stomach is getting a little flatter I don't know maybe it is a placebo effect although I am not eating as much right now because again I'm going through some shit okay I don't have an appetite anymore I don't know if it's because of the supplements I'm taking or because I'm going through this mental shit but I haven't been really eating much maybe it is the two supplements that's making me suppress my appetite um I lost about one pound 
not a lot i'm hoping that i'll lose more i don't want to say how much i weigh but my husband and i oh my god my hair is like a lion my husband and i did this bet where if i lose about 10 pounds 20 pounds was it 10 10 to 20 pounds i don't remember but he says if I lose between 10 to 20 pounds, I could spend $750 on clothes. And I think he did this bet because like, I hate how I look. Um, like every time I go shopping and I try on an outfit, I like feel so ugly and I'm not happy with myself. And I end up coming out of the dressing room sad because... I didn't like how the outfit looked on me so he did this bed to really push me and to make me feel good about myself um, I want to point out that he doesn't think I'm fat and he doesn't think that I'm ugly he tells me I look good every time I come to the dressing room and, and he tells me that I should get it it's actually like him that picks up good outfits for me maybe that's the problem maybe I'm the problem because he's good at picking outfits but every time I try on outfits that I pick out, I look terrible. Maybe I'm the problem. Okay, right. I received another. Is there my address here? I received another package. I don't know what I got, so we'll see. I think it's another PR gift. It's from Korea, so I think it's um PR. It's a big box or something so small. It is, I think it's the body cream. So I got soothing gel lotion from Auto Pump. I think this will be great for the summertime when you get like sunburn. I can use that. I got Real Barrier Aqua Soothing Sun Lotion and Real Barrier Aqua Soothing Sun Stick. I love sun stick. I actually want to open this up. Ugh. It looks like this. It's very small. It smells fresh. Cool down heated skin for face and body. Dermatologist tested. Ooh, okay. I love, love sun sticks because it doesn't get your hand messy. And then I got Derma B Fresh Moisture Body Lotion. I haven't really tried Real Barrier, but I've tried Auto, Auto Palm, Auto Palm, and I have tried Derma B and they have like the best body products like if you have dry skin if you have irritated skin they just have really 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 good body cream body lotion body wash so i'm very excited to try them so that's what i got